my god. What's up guys? Mike RC. Just wanted to show y'all something I kind of slapped together. So what you're looking at is a Traxxas Stampede 4x4. This is when they originally released. It had a two-pole VXL system on it. And yeah, not a whole lot else. I did put the shorter body mounts. Anyways, it's got MIP XCVD axles, and that's pretty much it. The rest of the driveline is completely stock. I had this Castle 2650 kicking around. I actually bought this motor on eBay a while back. They're floating all over eBay. I don't know if they're real castles or like maybe it's the OEM like manufacturer of them. Just have a bunch of them because Castle doesn't use this motor anymore, or at least this style of motor. All their motors now kind of look like this one. So, anyways, it's an older style motor. I think I paid sixty bucks for it, so I was like, "Screw it, let's give it a shot." So it's the fifteen twelve twenty six fifty kV. We have the Sidewinder Eighth ESC and stock steering servo, stock receiver, all that stuff stock. So. What I want to do real quick is I haven't even run the truck yet. It's got these eBay aluminum shocks on it too that are pretty nice. I think I need to put a little bit thick of oil in those. But anyways, we're going to throw this Spectrum 100C 4S in it. And that's it. We're going to go kind of just, I'm just going to take it outside the house real quick. We're going to rip it up and down the street and just kind of see how it drives. I have no idea if the gearing's right. I have no idea, you know, how this truck's actually going to drive. And this battery is about only half charged. So let's just go give it a real rip real quick. And in the next video, we're probably going to take it to a huge dirt line just to really let this thing rip. The only thing that's going to concern me is because the wheelbase is so short on this Stampede, it's going to be wheelie happy and it's not going to handle great, but we're still going to give it a shot. And I'll, as you can see, I'm running the trencher tires, so tons of grip. And yeah, I don't think we'll break anything because like I said, we already have the XCVD axles, but that's it. So I'm going to get the battery in. We're going to get a body on it. Actually, I'm not going to run a body screw. We're going to put the battery in and just go outside and rip it. All right, so I got the radio. It took me a while to find it. So let's go give this thing a rip and see what it does. All right, so I'm gonna try to film and drive with one hand. So we'll see how that goes. Pretty coggy, it's the uh, non-censored motor. Oh, okay, the slipper clutch is way too loose. You hear that? We got to go tighten that. So let me go tighten the slipper clutch real quick and we'll get back to it. Okay, we're back in our workshop. There's the slipper clutch nut way down oops, way down there. So I'm going to try to find something I can grab that with. But that's it. We're going to put a little bit more tension on that and then we'll take it back outside. Okay, I got it as size I can get it without pulling the motor out. A uh, quick little tech tip. If you're ever curious how to keep these wires from flopping around, put a zip tie loosely around your, your uh, hold down. And then you just feed the wire through and connect it. And it kind of helps keep all these cables from flopping around. So... That's it, let's take it back outside. All right, I wasn't recording for the first five seconds and I was going and this thing immediately slid on its top. So we kind of rashed up the body post. But anyways, I got a camera person. Fast as I can get a horse this guy's moving. Hang on, wait for power. We got a ton of power. All right, I guess I'll also, I'm gonna go down here, do a quick speed run, and we'll try to do some cool wheelies. It's very hard to drive, it's very fast. I haven't been able to go full throttle, Are you ready? Ooh, I'm scared to hit something. Here, I'll, I'll come the other way. All right, I think we're clear. fast. Here, I'll pop a little wheelie. Oh my god. Oh no. I didn't mean to do that. This thing's spicy. I was trying to be cool and do some wheelie. Here, I'll do another full speed pass. You ready? All right, ready? So much power, you can just like tap. 
It'll do a wheelie at any speed. All right, guys, so we kind of flipped it over once and tore the body post up, but they're metal, so that's okay. I guess next video we're going to put a body on it, and then I'm going to go somewhere where we can actually open this thing up. I wasn't able to get full throttle. I got pretty close for about one second, but there's just really not enough room on the street, and I don't want to whack a car. So I think the next location, I'm going to fully charge this battery because that was about a half-charge battery, put a body on it, and then that's it. We're going to see how fast it goes. Um, these tires balloon a lot. They have a lot of grip, but these things were getting really big, so... That's going to be it for right now. So just a kind of a quick little run video and that's it. Look forward to the next one.